Now, this is a sapling. It's a short simulation game where you design your own plants and animals. It's a little, a uh, little uh, sim earth kind of, uh, not really sim earth, but a little plant designer, animal designer kind of game. Uh, I played it before, back when it came out, which was back in December, and uh, there's been some updates. Dev men talked to me and uh, and said, hey, check out the new update. There's one that came out. The flower update came out in August, and that's what we're going to see today. So uh, by Wessel Stoop, and let's try it out here. Um, remember correctly on this one, it's it's one of those things where you like you, you have a little island, you plant your plants, you kind of create the plant, uh, and then you... Oops. Um... You sort of like advance time and watch the watch the game, watch the plants develop and, and evolve and all that. Thanks, Wessel. Spore about plants. Uh yeah, well there's animals in here also. Apparently they have flowers now. Um in here too. What a happy little intro about life and evolution. Okay, yeah. New game. We have the island. We have a beginner. Uh, we have islands for beginners. Mountain, leaves, and roots to get damaged in some environments. Let's deal with that. Let's do the uh, the beginner thing real quick. We also have a sandbox. Make sure one species with, has, with branches survives a century before the year 1000. All right. So it doesn't not grow fruit, so we'll not have offspring. So we got to give it some fruit. Blink. And then we got to make sure we get it some um, leaves. I guess we got, it'll eventually like evolve into something else. We can also deal with the roots. I think we can actually move them around, right? I'm not sure how to do that. We can put this guy wherever we want it. Um, yeah, that's fine. I can slowly turn it. Okay, uh, yeah. Um, ready. Welcome to my little island. Species name is Ala. Pop it down right there. Put a few of them down. A nice, a nice, whoops, nice little collection of Ala. Right there. Okay, I'm ready. First step towards every scenario's goal is to create a plant that can survive the lands without any help. So we have a one species that survives for a century. When we do that, we can unlock these sculpting tools. Okay. So, I think mostly what we do is we sort of sit back. We kind of just, you know, take it easy here. Uh, we can pause the game if we need to. We can sideways pause the game. Pause the simulation. What's that? Speed up. Okay. We just sort of let things go. That's 17 years right there. Uh, we can see our species and our health. We have Ala. A couple of them are Okay. We have the, the generations. I think what we do is we just let it go, though. And hope they all survive. It's been how long? 42 years. Oh, 100 years is our goal. We're at 73. We still just have the one. Okay, Lustrous Life. Unlock the sculpting tools in the editor. Next task is to have, make sure a, a, that one taller species survives a century. Okay, and we'll get branches. Let's go into here. Can I edit you? Make it bigger. Okay. Can also... Ooh! Dancing. Dancing. Oops. Put that back. Okay. Yeah. A little taller. I guess we'll go big. Okay, okay, ready. Pop this guy down here. It's still the same one. It's a little crooked. That's okay. Ready. First Ala was born. Yeah, yeah. Let's make time go. We've also, oh, we got a couple of little originals in there. And I think the idea here is they will sort of start to mutate. Which we can actually, we have a mutate button if we wanted to. And we'll go into the 100 years here. 
Active for at least 100 years. Is that not a taller species? Maybe we need to make a new one. Can we do a new one? <laughs> yes, I, I, surely I can. From scratch. Here we go. Let's do that. Big guy. Yeah, real big guy. I want to put a couple of these on here. Boink. And then we'll go. This is going to be real fruity. Yeah, yeah. Extra fruity. A little bit uh, wonky. And... Um, can I put another stem on there? Oh, yeah, I can. Okay, okay. Okay. Oops. Let's take some stems on. Stem there. Stem there. What a beautiful plant. I don't think I've ever seen a more beautiful plant than that. So basically by putting these things in here, I think it's adding to my energy profit. And how much it needs for fruit is all I kind of put in there. Uh, the pirate ship game was was um, Pirate Quartermaster. You can uh, you can, if you go to YouTube, you can you can scroll back a little bit if you want to watch that one. Okay, we'll do that. Ready. Okay, and uh, Wombala they call it. There's Wombala. Wombala seems to be surviving. I want to see some animals. I'm assuming that's a taller species. All of extinct. Oh, That's a shame. How far are we? How taller species are alive for at least 100 years. Is this not, is this not it? Hmm. Oops. It's been a while though for these guys. How long do they need to, to need to grow? I don't think I can get any taller. Hover over this dot. Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Let's go jumbo. Okay. 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 Yeah, I want you real, yeah, real squiggly. More squiggly, the better. There we go. Can you go in higher than that? Yeah, we can. Okay. Uh, the roots, we can make them bigger. Something, some sort of root. So uh, there's no energy profit right now because there's no parts. So we got to make fruit. Can I put on, uh, need more sunlight, so you need more leaves. Put some of those guys on here. You need a lot of leaves because you're going to be... Because you're a big guy. There we go. Did I do... I think I did a, I did a video on this one, right? Yeah, I did a video on this one a long time ago. Right? I said I did. And now that I'm saying... Now that I'm playing this, I'm debating. I remember playing it. I'm pretty sure I did a video. <laughs> okay, let's go there. How are we doing now? We have decent energy profit now. We don't need that much for fruit because there's no fruit on here. So let's put some fruit on there. Here we go. Okay. Some of those. Some of those. Come on, buddy. Get on there. Okay. Can I throw one over on this side? Put it on the side I can see. Okay, put it way down there. Yeah, yeah. That's fine. Okay, there we go. There we go. Uh, doesn't need much fruit to grow. It'll grow some fruits. And we got some yeah, yeah. You are good. Can I name you? Nope. You are named Ozus. All right, Ozus. I want to see you thrive, buddy. Go, uh, go sit on that rock. That'd be nice. Okay, ready. Now let's watch big guy. Watch big guy go. Ooh, Ozus is getting big. This is toppling over. In the many years. Wow. We've lost all of our baby ones. There's the animals tab. I want to see that. Uh, Wombala went extinct. Not enough space to grow. There's not many species to make space. Okay. We got pretty plants. We unlocked branches. 
Uh, we need a, a one that has branches to survive. So let's go. Can I just edit you and give you some branches? Branches. All right, there we go. Oh yeah, yeah. Whoop. Okay. Okay, like that. Wink. Yeah, it's crazy. Can you fit? Oh yeah, it's kind of, kind of, uh, it's got a nose. There we go. Okay, now let's put some more fruit on the branches. This is this energy profit of not. So let's put some leaves on here. To get some leak to get some um, some energy. Hey, Burns Flipper, how's it going? Mayor Burns. We're just, just making some plants. Just uh, just casual day to day. We apparently need a lot more leaves. <laughs> Our plant is too big. More leaves. How much sun are you catching? You're using all the energy. All right, all right, we're working on it. I need bigger leaves for this guy. Are we getting there? Does that say sun caught? Oh, that's just this one leaf type. Are you still not making any energy? How far negative are we? Is that... Are we three bars negative? Throw it in there. And... I don't know, um, maybe I need to remove some of the, maybe the stems are too big. Because I got leaves, leaves pretty much everywhere that I can, they can go. Is that, is that going to help? Ah, here we go, here we go. Okay, stems too crazy. Produce a couple fruit. There's a little bit of an energy profit. I'm assuming that's going to be good. Probably want a little more than that. So let's go throw a couple of these guys on here. If we can get them on there. Okay. I'm ready. Not a lot of room for these guys. So let's just sort of space them out. I'm assuming they'll take over the other ones. I'm hoping they do. Okay. Oopai. Oopai was born. Oopai was extinct. We can exterminate exterminate a species. We should do that. Uh, pause. So exterminate um, this one. What did it say? There we go. All right. So this guy we want to put out there. Just like three of them. That should be enough. <laughs> All right, and away it goes. Who's got a funny little nose on it? Cactus make the best plants. I can't keep anything alive either. But cactus, I can keep cactus alive. I have an aloe vera. I don't do much with plants, but I have an aloe vera. I have an, and I have a pine tree that I have uh, I've successfully kept alive for a while. I thought I killed the aloe vera. It was outside and freezing last year. And I brought it in, but it, like, turned black and soupy, and it was real sad. Um, but it came back uh, this summer. I, I like, it It was mostly dead. Um, it was like There was, like, a, a hint of not soupy black part to it. So I stuck it outside whenever the, uh, whenever the summertime hits. And it's back. It's back. It's, it's, it's going crazy, growing all over. It's a very happy plant now. Okay, next scenario. Let's do it. Okay, make sure one space, one species of with leaves survives a century at the highest, before the year one thousand. All right, let's make a tall guy, and uh, can I make him a little bit? Oh yeah, we can. Oh, we can fatten him up like this. Okay, okay. Yeah, it's gonna be like a like a Dr. Seuss plant is what I want. Uh, I got my my cat. Luckily, doesn't doesn't seem to have a uh, fascination with plants. So, she leaves him alone. 
I need... Where's my stems at? I can't put stems in here? Alright, fine. Let's throw these guys on here. Let's get enough of this. Well, then, we'll, then we'll throw some, some fruit on there. It doesn't have to be anything crazy. My only goal here, really, is just to get it to the last thousand years. I wonder if I should go a little smaller because of the space needed. No, that just ruins my leaves. Just a little, uh, a little stumpy guy. What's that? Oh, he wants some fruit, right? Let's not turn these things. They're all, like, bare on one side, I think. Aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> okay, that's the fruit side. And now some fruit. And we'll do one more fruit. Make sure there's plenty of fruit for this guy to do what he does. I could make an aloe vera, actually. Okay, I'm ready. What's it, what's it called? Ooh, look at this one. Oh, oh, I didn't even notice this. As we zoom in, you can see where my cursor is. It tells me, like, the temperature and the, uh, the wind speed and all that. So we'll set him, uh... Ula Bob. We'll set him down here. We'll stick one up here to see if he does alright. We'll stick one way up here. He probably won't survive, but we'll try it. Oh, I see. I see each zone. Okay. I'm ready. Milestone. Pretty plants. Look, one taller species survives a century. Okay, unlock branches. We already unlocked branches, but we're going to do it again. Okay, the Ula Bob's taken over. Nothing up here. Very happy. But they're doing fine down in the south. All right, there we go. We got a thousand years. Oh, a hundred years. Hundred years. Okay, branches have been unlocked. Let's. Uh, ooh, what's this? Ah, shallow water, deep water, uh, softness, temperature, wind strength. Okay, okay. Um, I would like to edit the ulabob and give it a branch. Ulabob needs a branch. Nothing crazy, but um, something to make ulabob recognizable. There we go, and then we put our fruit on the edge here. Boink. And then uh, and another one. Boink. I don't really know what we do, like... I guess it has to do with our roots, which I can't really do anything with. Next, star froth. We can make them go wider, I guess, if we want to make them go out. We can also do... Can I do the thing where I make them fatter? No. I can't really do much with roots. Can I, I can make them deep. Oh, I can make them deeper. Oh. Okay. So this guy's going to be a little stumpier. Deeper roots. We'll see if he can survive up here. Pretty crazy up there. But we're ready. Uh, Awuzia. With the, the ones on top died already. I think they're doing it. Yeah, the little stem ones that you can see. So there's a mixture of, of each of them. We can always kill off the other guys if we want to, which we may if these are dying out, but I think they're okay. Yeah, they're still hanging out in there. It's fine. Uh, active for at least 100 years at the highest... Oh, highest, highest peak. Okay, hang on. Read my notes. So up here... How do I see the uh, uh, pause the simulation? Where do I see these notes here? So I guess it has... What's the deal here? It's very windy. Windy and cold. And there's very deep groundwater. Okay. Um, let's make a new one then. Let's uh, let's just do an old, a whole new one. From scratch. Let's make it nice and stumpy. Like I, that, That's what I want. I want stump. Um, we'll give him, we'll give him one more of those. We need some fruits. I may give it a branch. I mean, actually, not give it a branch. It's just got to survive the, the cold. It just needs deep roots. Hey, Andrew. Something like that, and we'll give it a couple hunks of fruit. Right there, and it may not even need two of them. We'll do two, and then the roots, however, have to go deep, like that, and out. Okay. That's our guy. Doesn't use much energy. He's got deep roots. I like it. OK, 
Okay, he's got to live up here. Okay, ready. Vag Vagabob? They all died. See, because wind damage, it leaves. What am I supposed to do about that, then? How do I fix that? Damage is leaves. What am I supposed to do about that? Um, I can make you bigger. Doesn't seem like it's going to work, though. Put the leaves on the ground. It's very windy. Maybe... Hmm. Okay, we'll try that. I'm gonna go up to here. Throw him in there. Okay, ready. No. The wind damages the lead. What am I supposed to do about it then? I'm not getting in. No tutorial! Hmm. Alright, we'll get rid of the leaves. Need more sunlight. So if we just say, make you big, you need some sort of leaves. I can't like, stems don't provide, do they? They provide, no, it takes energy to make, to make a stem. Maybe I can, like, stuff some leaves underneath, uh... It's like a little elephant, man. Um, under here? I don't know if this is gonna work. I'll stuff them under there, see what happens. This is a new species. Okay, ready? They all die. Strong winds damage its leaves. Ay, 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 ay. Fine. No leaves. No stem. Need more sunlight. Oh, yeah, root. Oh, yeah. I can go straight down. I don't think I can really do with this. We'll do um, just one fruit. Need more sunlight. Um, maybe we just go with just tall. Two large needs more water. More sunlight. Mm, there we go. Maybe we got it. No leaves. It says it's going to work. Okay. Okay. One leaved species for 100 years at the highest peak. Well, why do you didn't say that before? Okay. Didn't say that before. I don't think it did. We're gonna, how am I going to get a leaf on here, though? It can't handle a leaf. Right on top. Okay. Okay. Nope. Pollination organs were still, were, were frozen. One leaved species. We don't have a leaved species. And I can't make a leaved species because it just freezes. At the highest peak. Maybe the wind's coming a certain way. Maybe they need to, they need to sit. That's not it. I don't know. We're finally surviving up here. But no, no leaves. I don't know what to do unless we just go, like, giant. This one we tried before. It didn't work because it's, it's leafy. Let's just go big. 
big and stumpy. Okay. On the sides, I don't know. Put them anywhere around here. Pollination organs were frozen. I don't know. Um, it is down low. Maybe we need to go higher with it. Where does that go? It might go somewhere. Can you go somewhere? There you go. Okay, we'll try that. Um... We can stick like a branch on top of it, I guess. Give it a little nose. Don't go up. Go go down. Just cover it up a little bit. <laughs> uh, not that one. No, no, no. I had it there. Just little stumps. Protect that guy. That's our, our only fruit. It's very valuable to us. Take some leaves on him. What did that say? It said something about temperature. Oh, here we go. The temperature goes minus 10 to, two, to 20. Let me do it now. Ready for them to die immediately? There they go. I don't know. I don't know. Some leaves and roots get damaged in some environments. So let's deal with that. Well, tell me how to do it. Hmm. I don't know. Anyone has any ideas? I'm I'm out of ideas. Nothing, nothing I can ever really do. I think this was, this one was my best. Three of those things are still alive, actually. I can put the fruit up on top. And uh, there's going to be a new species, apparently. Put it real low to the ground, maybe. Can I go any stumpier? Extra stumpy. Take that on there. More sunlight. Okay, there it goes. Stick your head in the sand, buddy. Um, well, there is no, um... Like, the heat map, and it's, it doesn't really matter. It's up here. We have to build... We have to grow up here. 100 years, highest point. Walladum. Walladum's extinct. Immediately. Immediately. Um, I don't know. I'm... I am, um... I'm at a loss. I don't know what else to do. We've got only a thousand years. Well, we'll go to a thousand years and see what happens. I think that'll be the end of the scenario. We'll see if we can unlock something. It's almost like we need a different leaf. We've got that little puny leaf that only goes up to like minus 10. Is that what it was? And the temperature up here is it's at minus 20 right now. So it. Unless it's something we, we need a different leaf. What do, do with those levels? More energy left over, something like that. Maybe. Try one more. Keep seeing anything when you over overlocked parts. Okay, so this is the guy that, that's surviving. No, nothing. Um... Temperature resistance, minus 50. Okay. 
You water it deep. If I were to give it this thing. Hmm. If we go high, though, we put it up here. It doesn't change anything. Yeah, no matter what we do, that's not going to work. If we do what we did before, it's always the same. It's called um, the sapling. Can I put leaves on the roots? No. Oh, wait, I can't? No. Of course not. That's silly. That doesn't change. That just changes the soil softness in the water. Let's try that. So it says it's good, but it also does say it's going to die. Unless we can, maybe there's something about like making, like making um, a bunch of little plants to create some sort of like a, some sort of a biome, you know? Maybe that's the thing. Um, whoops. Look, what we do is we set these guys up here. Okay, we're ready. But then before we begin, we go grab this guy. We set him all around. Some sort of a um, walladry biome. Okay. Nope. And we just killed everything off. Well, we'll hit the 1000 mark and we'll see what happens. Which is now. Almost. Well, down below, they're really good. But the, uh... You guys do not do bad. Do not be the project of... Um... But I don't know how to do it. Alright. Um... Wasn't there a, um... A sin box? Can we do this? Okay. Can't get everything? Is everything unlocked? Yeah! Here we go, here we go. Okay, we got flowers now, too. And, ooh, what's that? I don't know what you are, but I like it. Like that. Um, oh, I see. Okay. We'll stick some flowers up there. Ooh. Give you a stem. Stick some, uh, some leaves on you. See if it can get you to survive. Our fruit, I guess, is the one thing. Okay, and then flowers, of course. So this, um, you know, this guy flowers all kinds of different flowers. He's a crazy one. Yeah, too large. Needs more water. Of course it does. There we go. Okay, give me my random map. Ooh, that's big. Okay, it's very cold up here in the mountains. It's 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 hot over here. There's a little bit of groundwater though. We went in all green spots. Will it, will, will it survive anywhere? My plant. It won't survive anywhere. There we go. Right there. That's the one spot it survives. Okay. I found, it. I found a good spot over here. 
quite enough groundwater. It'll hopefully... Let's see. Let's make some... Uh, let's mutate. I guess it needs to go for a little bit. Let me mutate it. It's surviving. Oh, it's doing pretty good in that little spot there. Can we mutate it now? Mutate that guy. Um, make him real sm oop. real small. Like like that. Can you go anywhere? Uh, back to the drawing board. Let's let's go a little less a little less root action on this one. Because I think it needs too much too much groundwater. Needs a deep water. Let's do something like that. Little roots. Little guy. Yeah. He can go anywhere. Mostly. Okay. So they should take off. Did I put a... Someone went extinct. Did I put a fruit on there? I guess I did. Well, maybe not. Yeah, they're there still. Yeah, they have those little those little guys. I guess that that's a that's a fruit. If I were to take, oh, what kind of animals we can make? Oh, look at that. Let's give them some. Oh, it's hideous. Get yeah, some of those. You have a fast way of spinning this thing. You don't touch the ground. Eh. There you go. No mouth. Let's give him a mouth. There you go. He eats nectar. Um. Is that ears? And we'll give him some uh, some eyeballs. Ooh, it's hideous. Well, eye stalks, I think. Make him a little smaller. Maybe we can stick him. Oh yeah, back here. <laughs> uh, <laughs> this is tail. Oh yeah, give him a light. Boink. There we go. Make him a little bigger if we want. Oh, that's a tail. No, I like it like that. That's good. These feet are just—they're just dangly. What's it called whenever the uh, the appendage that doesn't get used anymore? Okay, that works better. Okay. He uh, he eats nectar. Doesn't not eat plants. Doesn't eat meat. He just eats nectar. Okay, so that means we need little flower plants. So let's pop him out over here by these guys. Okay. And let's check on him. Let's go zoom in, make sure he's surviving. There they go. Oh, they got a lot of flowers over here to live on. Yeah. What this... Random mutation on him. Uh-huh. Oh, can't I can't on recently introduced ones. We can um, get out of this menu. Can I do a mutation on one of these plants? A random mutation. Seven days old. Mutate. The same thing we did before. Yeah. Okay. Um, let's put some lower flowers on him. Make sure these eggs can survive. Give me a little bit smaller. Just a little little guy is all we want. Okay. And does it have it does have a fruit. Let's give it another fruit so it can survive maybe a little longer. Assuming it can can survive that. Give me more fruit. Okay. And I'll give you another um the leaf. That's the sun guy. There we go. Okay, where can you survive? Survive where there's groundwater. Which is over here. I just don't want you taking away... And there's water here. Why is there no groundwater? Is it? Where is the water at? Dang desert. Because we got to make it not a desert. Here we go. Patches over there. Any more patches we can put these things out? Let's put a whole bunch. Like, whether they survive or not, we're just going to make a whole bunch of them. 
Let's do a lot of red X's. Yeah, it ain't gonna survive anywhere else. But it's okay. Alright, ready. They all die off. But over here, we got something going. These guys are chowing down. Look at the fancy lights. Ooh. Little babies. Lots of flowers. Well, that one went extinct because it didn't have a space to grow. Uh, which one? The new... I don't know which one that was. <clears throat> These are slowly growing. Look, we're taking over the land here. Dairy was stinked. Who's dairy? We're frozen. Who's dairy? Um, that little stumpy guy. That's the one I put everywhere? I don't think so. You don't live anywhere. There's no place for you to live. I think this is the one that had the roots too deep. I think was the problem. No groundwater. Yeah, I think. I don't think there's any place at all for these guys to survive. Alright. Medu went extinct. Not enough energy for its offspring. It might be a mutation of these guys. Can we mutate mutate these guys? Oh yeah, random patient no on. Mutation's on. That's what's going on. I think these guys are they're mutate mutating. Um yeah, let's what's this do? Time jump. Did everything die? No, no, they're still there. Okay, looking good. That one has like a little baby on his back. Who doesn't? It's just weird eyes. Okay. Let's yeah, time jump some more. Okay. Let's uh, how far are we going ahead? We've gone a thousand years already. I want to see them. They are slowly starting to make their way out. Which is kind of neat. Somebody's back there playing the drums. These little animals are living. We need to find something. Let's go, let's go find um, something that can grow over here. So let's take from scratch. We're going to do one of those little stumpy guys that worked before. And oh, wait, wait, wait. I'm going to just pick one. The ones we did on the previous games. So we had the one that w did really good, which was... Um, I don't remember which one it was. Oh, no, these are all from this game. Um, oh, he's brown. Oh. If you had like, let's just make a new one. No, no, I won't do that. I want to. I want to make a new one. I want from scratch. We're gonna make a little stump. This little guy, he can be um, a, a big guy. A little stump. And the roots, I think, are probably fine. Give him a little. A little bit of that. And let's put on the fruit. And a fruit. And I think we just need to put in um, some little leaves. Let's stick with the basic guys. They work. Stick with them. If you both put the roots too deep, they only survive on, on deep water. There's not a lot of that around here. That's what the other ones have. So we kind of want... I think we want like a shallow root system on this thing. I think. And we'll give it a flower just because... I want wind pollination? No, I think I want one that doesn't have wind pollination. 
Oh no, it's either wind or animal. Never mind. This one does both. Okay, we'll do that. Come there. There you go. Maybe two of these. It doesn't want to stick to it. Okay, one it is. Um, now, how's the stats? Can we, can we see them somehow? Requires soil softness of five. Because the roots are... Um, if that's shallow water, I'm not sure what we have is if, out there. Ah, there we go. So as often as we can go. There we go. There we go. Nice and pointy roots. Okay. Um, oh, yeah. Give it some bark. Is that what we want? What's bark do? We can make it, make it wind resistant, I guess? Flower color? Oh, yeah. Make some nice uh, nice blue flowers. Bioluminescent? Oh, yeah. Okay. We're ready. Hey, Carol. Water lilies. Oh, I don't know. I, I don't... I think it has to have... I don't think so. I saw a spot over here somewhere. There's one. Okay. Good. As well as kind of want a nice little area over here. It can always mutate a little bit. And maybe... They can't quite handle the heat from over here. But in time, it'll mutate. It'll evolve into being something... Hopefully that can fill up this whole area. I like these little kinds of games. These, these little... Uh, these little Evolution sim games. I like these a lot. Just sort of sit back and let things do the thing. Lots of stuff can fit in here. I'm hoping that we can make an area that maybe the animals can, can slowly make their way towards. We don't want to compete with that. I can't put things... Oh, I can't go... I can't go... I can just go on the edge of the water. It's like cattails and things. Too cold up there, but we'll go ahead and go. Okay. So a lot of them will die out. We can keep and get a good look at them here. Hey, hey, look. Let's look at them. Let's zoom in. They're, uh, they're just a stump. With a nice blue leaves. A little patch there, a little one there, and a little one over here. And they seem to be surviving. Mutations are on, so they should slowly start to grow. Let's do a time jump. How far did we go? We went like 500 years. <gasps> look at that! Ooh, yeah, look at that! Are these, all these little guys? Ooh, they got weird. They got bigger. And if I look at you, Mildanus. Okay. Sure. Uh, no, I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. I want to look at the tree. Hang on. Where's my... Um... <laughs> I like caterpillars now. <laughs> I played this game a long time ago called Intelligent Design. It was kind of a similar thing. Yeah, I, I love that thing. That game. It's weird, but I liked it. It looks like a couple animals have made it, but they don't want to go too far over here. Maybe too too hot or something. I think this is my my tree. Yeah, we have the one animal who only eats nectar. So maybe we need someone that can eat eat dead plants or something. Oh, here's a new guy. Oh yeah, he's got some weird ears. Nice. No, he's he's not, not alive anymore. There's Ouija. He's dead. What's, can we see ones that are alive? Is that what that is? Yeah. So we have Zayling, who's been around for the original, and uh, and that guy. Okay. I'm not sure what that button does. What's that do? Does it raise the temperature of the whole area? We don't want to do that. Let's not touch that. Uh... <laughs> Make face huggers. 
can't handle the, the camera controls here. Okay. All right, let's do uh, a few a, a few more millennia. Make this place nice and green. Actually, make an in the water on this side, and they can they're slowly making their way out. Animals are still on that one spot over there, though. What if we made like a little like a little mouse kind of animal? Tiny little guy. He can survive better, right? A little like yeah, a little flea. Let's give him some. Gonna be quiet. We want um not loud. We want a quiet. Yeah. Can I make him any smaller than that? Just a little two-legged guy. He eats plants. Yeah, just eats plants. Uh, plants and nectar. Sure, sure. Why is it upside down? Why is it, <laughs> why is it upside Oh, is that? No, that's not upside down. That's, that's right. Let's get this backwards, though. We want, like... Come in, come in. There you go. Uh... <laughs> Uh, we'll give him some some good hearing, I think. I don't, we don't have any carnivores, so it doesn't really matter too much. Yeah, there you go. Um, I think that's with instincts before. Can I give you some eyes? Do you need eyes? I don't have any room for eyes. No room for eyes. Oops. We can give him... Okay, we'll put his eyes on his tail. <laughs> no, none of that. Uh, how about a... Oh, yeah, here we go. Can I make him smaller? I need smaller eyes, like, like spore style. Make smaller eyes. Okay, it's for... Yeah, that's great. That's great. That's great. And, uh, of course, he's going to have a little... Yeah, right under his eyes. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, he eats plants. Instincts. Oh, yeah, new instinct. Um... If you see a light in the dark, then go towards it. Okay? Um, if you hear the sound, the noise of the, um, the noise of a dying plant. No? I don't know. Then, oh. Okay. If you see those blue leaves, uh, no, we'll just get rid of that one. I don't think I can now. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so if, if you see, what was that one? I don't know. If you see, if, if you see that, then you go that way. Let's make him a nice, a nice purple. Did not eat meat. Good. Okay, buddy. Come on out. Welcome to your new world. I've been playing this game a lot more than I thought I would be playing it. I thought I saw someone say something about it. Oh, beak things. Yeah, there it is. Guy. Make some beak things. I don't know if you guys will survive over here, but I'm going to put you in each of these little patches. There you go. I don't want to put too many more of them. I'm afraid these things are going to eat all those. So each patch has its own little family. And let's see if they survive. They're kind of hard to see because they're tiny. But let's let's go. They're bouncing around over there. There's some over that way. And there's some there. I really just want to see them mutate. Oh my, they're hideous. They're little glowing butts. Hey buddy, I want to mutate. Oh no, no, I want to. I want you to just sort of auto mutate. We'll follow you around. You're gonna go around and eat things. He's getting hungry. But he can eat. He can hop around. He made it. He's 60 days old. What a geezer. Yum, yum, yum. Hey. <laughs> Looks like the cyber truck. <laughs> yum, 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 yum. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Good job, buddy. 100 days old. How y'all doing? I wish I... Where's my button to see who's alive? Species. Oh, that's what I wanted. Ooh, there's a lot of things over there. Is there things over there? Wow, look at all that. Who's green? 
I don't know what these are. I don't know what they are, but they, they're over there. This is kind of dying out over this side. There's a couple of animals over there. That's it. Yeah, they all. Those are all gone. This side is doing really well. Hey now, let's fast forward. Equilinox. Yeah, Equilinox is a little bit, a bit more. Um, I guess a bit more. This one's puzzly, as we saw before, but it's also um, um, abstract. Is that the word? Equilinox. You got like real animals, sort of. Let's do it again. Doesn't seem to be getting any much much growth. Uh, it's sort of shifted a bit. If I were to say, like, if we come down here and look, where's my um, I think telling me the temperature and all that. I don't know. If we were to raise the temperature or lower it or something, would it? I'm sure it would change some things. I don't see any animals anymore. My animals all died off, I think. Uh, well, there's somebody. There's there's one of the original guys. He's a little fat. He's a fatter version of the original guy. Oh, my kangaroo guys are over here, I think. They've all shifted. Yeah, here they are. They all look pretty much the same. After a thousand years, three thousand years, how, how far we went. They're pretty much the same. Where is that other guy? I think we lost our originals. Just have the uh, the 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 rat kangaroos. All right. Well, that may, that's pretty neat. I like it. I can toy the, toy with this thing for a while. But we're not gonna. So we're gonna call it a day. Uh, let's uh, let's quit. Let's play something else. So there is uh, the sapling's been out for a while. It came out in end of the last year. Um, I do have a video on the channel. I do remember recording it, and uh, it's now still being updated. Which will be, I played for an hour and a half. No, no, that was before. I played for a while. Uh, there you go. So by old Wessel Stoop. All right, um, what's next?